It seems like everything would eventually come to an end sooner or later. And this is what happened to this male lion. This fellow was seen in a terrible shape, patchy mane, very dirty, and unable to move his lower legs. It seems like his spine was injured entirely and he was in great pain. Not too far away were three other males watching their friend suffer. After struggling for a minute, the poor lion breathed his last breaths and died while being ripped apart by jackals. This is the last moment of a male lion, and it is for sure very hard to watch. But there is a reason for everything. That male lion actually got kicked out of his pride. You heard me right. The king was banished from his own land. But why would they do that? What will be the fate of the exiled male lions? Lions live in family groups, and this is extremely crucial for them to survive in the wild. But instead of staying together for as long as possible, the pride is constantly kicking out its members. Oftentimes, these are males. Both young ones and adults, even old lions. What happened to respect for old age? But believe it or not, age is exactly the issue here. The moment male lions reach adulthood, the older males of the pride simply kick them out. Because in this period, they start producing more testosterone, indicating that they have developed the capability for reproduction and hence could be a challenge to the existing lions, leaders of the pride. They basically see the young ones as potential threats. Something that sounds unusual for humans is a special right in the animal kingdom. Imagine coming home from school with your parents packing your bags and kicking you out of the house because of your rocketing testosterone level. That would be confusing, frustrating, and uh, weird. The same thing goes for the lions. They were cast out into the world where they have to live through on their own, though the chance of them surviving is pretty slim. This is an ancient rite, and most likely it comes as a surprise for young lions. They are not warned about this, they are simply kicked out without the right to come back. After the first exile, some of them would hang out near the pride's territory for a while, hoping that the elder lions will change their minds. But of course, that will not happen. The pride consists of females, and none of them stand up to protect their grown children. This is because being a single mother is already hard enough, especially in the savanna. They'd have to hunt alone while protecting the offspring at the same time, and that is way too much work. But, believe it or not, lionesses will always be welcomed back to the pride as they are the backbone of the group. They hunt, guard, and raise their babies. And let's be honest, male lions can only protect the territory, at times, and pose for beautiful photos. <laughs> So, what should he do? He has nowhere to go, no family, nothing. Would he be able to survive? Well, he'd have to no matter what. Usually, he would form alliances with other male lions. They can be his cousins or brothers, and the new pride have to stay together in order to exist in this harsh environment. Unfortunately, the nomadic time of a male lion's life is also the time the majority of them lose their lives. But, how do the rare few suddenly know how to make it by themselves when they've depended on family their entire lives? Well, there are two things that either make or break a young male lion after he leaves the pride. Luck and genetics. If he's strong, smart, and lucky, life will be much easier. Together, they will teach each other to hunt, rule, and strengthen their skills. Young males may stay prideless for several years before they acquire a proper pride. When the time comes, brothers, male cousins, and even members of the same bachelor group may rule a pride together. Up to three males may live in a single pride. They will now have everything they need to start a family of their own. They will find and bring lionesses into the family. Through an intricate process, they start having babies, and the cubs will grow up ready to be kicked out of the pride again, just like their dads. This right is a must for them, and there's no avoiding it. 
Well, now I'm rethinking my wish to become a lion. Yep, it's hard to believe, but the life of a young lion is fraught with hardship and violence. Let's be honest, the animal kingdom has one of the most ruthless and most difficult rules to follow, but it makes sense, I'm not gonna lie. But that's it for now. I'll see you later.